Oh, 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 no, no, no. You saw, you saw nothing, you saw nothing. I take it back. This wasn't quite as easy as I had hoped for. What's up guys, and welcome back to Thief Simulator. So last episode, we managed to steal a toaster, a teapot, a frying pan, a whole lot of garbage. It didn't really live up to the master thief lifestyle that we're going after, but today, that's gonna change. Blocking path. Excuse me, ma'am, I'm trying to do an intro here, if you don't mind, so you could just take your four foot three Humpty Dumpty looking ass. Did you just call the police? I didn't do anything illegal. I just standing here on the sidewalk minding my own business. Oh, you're both calling the police. Oh, I wouldn't let them walk past me. And apparently that's illegal. The police are on their way. Well, you know what they say, in for a penny, in for a pound. The joke was gonna be that I was gonna pound her head in with a crowbar, but this game has a moral compass and you just, you can't cross that line. Like I was saying before I was so rudely interrupted, today that's gonna change. Okay, we're going after a bigger heist because we're gonna be playing this a little bit smarter. We're gonna do some surveillance of a place beforehand. We have more tools at our disposal. We can pick a lock. We don't have an exorcist on call though, so maybe we won't go after this house, okay? I, I think actually Vinny has us going for 111 Greenview at 7 a.m. It's currently 11.30, so maybe I'll just hop in my car and go to the pawn shop. We have a backpack full of stuff right now, and I'm sure I can maybe make my way there without running over somebody or, I don't know, missing a stop sign, breaking some kind of stupid law. People were asking on last episode if I can steal anything from the pawn shop, and Welcome I don't back. think I can. But even if I could, I wouldn't want to, right? I don't want to get on Igor's bad side. That'd be bad for business. He buys all my useless crap for quite a bit of money. Now, okay, I may need this. Used pot, $8, okay. Yeah, saucepan, saucepan, old toaster, saucepan, and another pot. He has a wide selection of old toasters and fuel pumps and magical air dandruff. So if anybody ever needs any of that, I'll send them to Igor, the guy with the face only a Russian mother could love. Managed to pass the day pretty quickly with Igor. He's a great conversationalist. And now we need to not run over people in the middle of the night and find our way to 111. And I can't park in the road. <laughs> I've come to learn that if traffic is blocked by your car or anything like that, people get really upset, so. You look good there. And you repaired yourself. Right, I smashed you against a bush last episode and completely destroyed the front, but now it, it's good? I'm trying to avoid unwanted attention. I really don't need my car furiously vibrating on the side of the road. <laughs> okay, it's fine, no one will notice. We're just gonna head over to 111, like Vinny told us to. And I'm guessing we need to crawl up here and scope the place out a little bit. That bitch from the beginning of the episode lives here. This is perfect. We're going to steal everything from her. So I think I need to mark my targets. How do I? There we go. And it routine discovered. What do you got to say, Vinny? There's a box in there. Wait for them to leave and get me that box. Okay, I'm sure that lady is gonna go call the police at a, a tree swaying in the breeze, but I'll, I'll give it a shot. So I have to wait for them to leave home before I can steal the important box. Apparently I'm too good to just break in and bludgeon them with a crowbar, so I'm gonna sleep in my car oh so inconspicuously. <laughs> yeah, that's not sketchy at all. Okay, so we'll just leave the door open, okay? I got nothing interesting to steal. I'm the only thief in town. Are they here? Did they leave? I think they're gone. No. Oh, okay. Do our first lock picking. Careful. 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 And we're in. It's just that easy. 
Bash myself in the nose with a door. What do you think they're hiding in here? Fragile. Box with shady content. Don't mind if I do. Now let's get the hell out of here. <laughs> no idea where they are. I marked them. Strange. I, I guess people have other things to do than be at home or aimlessly walk around this town. <laughs> it's like they live their own lives. We completed that objective. Five star stealth bonus, five XP, 25 thief rating, C. What do you mean C? Like, what are these arbitrary ratings? <laughs> In retrospect, I shouldn't be making fun of Igor's face. All right, Vinny, I got your box of crap. Send the box via Black Bay. Okay, so he wants me to sell it online. Am I gonna find out what's inside? Because I really wanna know. <laughs> Black Bay, and I'm guessing it would be under other? Yeah, a box with shady content, $100. Not too bad. Where are you, Vinny? I miss you, there he is. <laughs> you know what, Vinny? I appreciate that, because he actually sent me to steal from somebody who wronged me. So I, I owe you two now, technically. The Lombardis think their friend on Greenview needs a new window but they think the one they got's fine. Go prove them wrong. Still don't really know much about the Lombardis. They seem like some kind of organized crime, but now I'm wondering if they're some kind of Windex Mafia. <laughs> Break a window in 111, then hide or run away. So not really stealing anything, just petty crime. In this line of work, sometimes you just need to get a little bit creative with the way you do things. Okay, that might have been a little bit too creative. <laughs> I just wanted to drive into the window, okay? This is all your fault. Oh, come on. Oh, there's a lot of police coming. Okay, you know what? In for a penny, in for a pound. It's what I keep saying. If, if we're gonna rob the place, then we might as well really rob the place. <laughs> I need to make back repair costs for my car, okay? Yeah, all the all this stuff looks good. What? The police will tow your car. They took my car hostage. You were gonna rat me out, weren't you? They're gonna take you back to that lot and you'd sing like a canary. You're lucky I got other windows to bash with this crowbar right now and that I kind of like you. Yeah, you guys go hang around back. Nothing suspicious happening here. <laughs> I feel like I do need to rob the place though, right? I, I can't just smash and run. There's so many interesting things here. I know Igor loves toasters, okay? But I only have so much space. I'll take the saucepan. Uh, maybe we can grab the TV. I don't have a whole lot of time to be doing window shopping, but a golden goblet will do. Thank you. And a landline. Uh, police aren't quite here yet. Ooh. Oh, they're, they're, they're back. They're, they're back. Okay, listen, you know what? Now I'm the one with hostages. I'm the one with hostages. Don't come in here. <laughs> I need to hide. I need to hide. Uh, uh, hiding spot. Hiding spot. There we go. They'll never think to look under the beds. Those look like police officer shoes to me. <laughs> Is this seriously going to work? There's police everywhere. They won't suspect my car, right? Because I parked it on the other side of the road. I didn't drive it onto their lawn this time. Oh my God, this is actually working. We lost a star. They're, they're seriously giving up already. Have the tenants come in here? They're gone. That was, that was it? It's so easy to rob places here. I can't believe it. Okay, so I have a backpack full of sweet stuff now. We could go sell that really quickly and, uh, I guess just get the hell out of here. How do I leave? Okay. Oh, 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 no, 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 you saw, you saw nothing, you saw nothing. I take it back. This wasn't quite as easy as I had hoped for. I'm in here, I have the stuff, but getting out is a whole nother problem because I think if they see me or I break a window, there's two stars, the police will be here in 30 seconds. I really don't want to make a run for it outside. So I'm at a loss. 
initiate raptor mode and ever so quietly sneak around the house and see if we can find a way out of here. Are they still in the front room? I don't think so. Did they fix the window that I smashed? She's literally sitting right next to the window that I smashed. <laughs> Lady, can you please just go to bed or something? Come on! Doctors probably told her not to sleep for too long because of the concussion I gave her with my crowbar. I'm just gonna have to try to slip past. Oh, oh, she, uh... She saw me, but she wasn't too startled. <laughs> just a little bit confused. Was that a man walking around like this in the living room with the crowbar? I can't be certain. Possibly. Maybe. Oh, oh, um... Yeah, can't quite get out the front door. So, oh, oh, is she, is she coming? I don't know what to do right now. Oh, she's gone. She, she went somewhere else. No, no, she's she's staring out the window that I need to go through. Okay, listen, lady, I'm really sorry. I'm really sorry about this, but I, I gotta go. I gotta, I gotta go. I, I, let me, let me through. You're blocking the way. Okay, okay, now run. Just run, run away. Don't, don't mind me. I gotta get rid of the crowbar. I gotta find a place to hide. There's gonna be a dumpster or something around here, right? Been sitting in this garbage for like two hours now. They're very unhappy with me, but they're not gonna find me. Why would they not think to check here? Honestly, it just it blows my mind. Under the bed, in a dumpster, I could probably climb a tree and they would never figure it out. But I'm in the clear, right? The police are gone. I can make my way back to my car and then I guess go to the pawn shop, right? Because we have a whole lot of stuff. That's not my car. What the hell is this? Sir, what did, oh. Am I seriously blocking tra- Just go around! What is wrong with you? <laughs> Dude, just move. Come on. Uh, at least he's not getting too upset, right? That's one thing. I I'm sure he probably could have called the cops and had me towed. All oh, this grass moving through my car. That that's not good. Let's just uh, start you up. Oh, I am so tempted to run this lady. Oh, just, just go around! Go around! Oh my god, there we go. Finally, that guy might have been there all day. I would love nothing more than to just wrap you around the hood of my car, lady, but I, I can't. I can't, okay? I got a golden goblet in my backpack. I gotta get the hell out of town. I love that Igor's is open 24-7. It, it's really handy. What's up, Vinny? You need to learn how to deal with standard locks. Okay. Learn lock picking level two. Oh, that's right. I've probably been leveling up this whole time. Lock picking level two. Don't mind if I do. So Vinny wants me to open a standard training lock, but right Build now I need to get rich. Right, we have a coffee machine worth $200. Why is it worth so much more than a golden goblet? I would have never thought. We also have a saucepan and a landline. Yeah, okay, so that's my biggest haul yet. So I'm guessing if I want to buy a standard lock, I probably need to buy an upgrade because that's just how these things work. Plus I have a whole ton of money to spend, so let's see what's for sale on uh, Tools for Thieves. We can get the regular lock pick, that's good, $70. Climbing gloves are $1,200! <laughs> that's a pretty big jump up, what the hell are they made of? Who would have ever guessed that Tools for Thieves would be run by actual thieves? Because charging $1,200 for a pair of gloves is just straight up criminal, okay? There is no way that I'm paying, I'm probably gonna end up paying that much, who am I kidding? This is the kind of lock that I was thinking about, right? I'm pretty sure I know how this works. I should just uh, bump them and then catch them in place. Okay, clicks are good noises, we don't, Want to screw it up because we'll lose all of our progress. There we go. Okay, I'm gonna make Vinny proud. I'm I'm gonna make Vinny proud for first try because he sees and knows everything somehow, right? <laughs> the very second I'm done picking the lock, he calls me. It, it's really weird. It's like I said, he's like my very thief mother. Are you proud of me, Vinny? If it ain't broke, fix it with a crowbar. Word on the street is the toilet in Greenview 113 is not broke. 
So, you want you want me to smash a toilet with a crowbar? I, again, I, I kind of want to be stealing things, but I'm guessing that's going to be a bit of a side hobby from now on in Thief Simulator. So we're looking for 113, which should be somewhere, yeah, over here, right next to 112. No, 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 come on. Okay, I'm tired of crippling people because my car is such a piece of shit. I'd like to point out that the controls for this thing are W, A, S, and D to move, but you'll notice that there's no brake. So you just kind of slam it into reverse and hit the gas and hope to stop eventually. Most of the time, I don't. It's just completely unbearable. You wait there. You think about what you've done. I gotta go smash a toilet, apparently. Please tell me I don't have to break a window. I'm so tired of having the cops call this episode. Mini electric lockpick. Great. Is there anybody home? If there's nobody home. That'd be one trespass. Tr whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, okay. Hold on, hold on. Not, not trespassing. Just uh, you know, observing. Here we go. Oh, don't mind if I do. Pick this really quick. That actually came in handy for once. Is there anybody hanging out back here? No, but there is an open window. This is perfect. There's no one home and there's an open window. I might actually get away with stealing stuff this time. Hello, headphones. Don't mind if I do. Uh, wouldn't mind a beer either. No. Too much to ask for, I guess. <laughs> How about you? Radio? Okay, I know I'm supposed to be smashing a toilet right now, okay? But uh, girls gotta eat. Gotta be some interesting things in this house, right? We're not gonna make off with toasters. We're gonna make off with alarm clocks and front door keys. That is very helpful. Baptism art? Oh. Okay. Leave that there for now. But I wouldn't mind making off with something that's big for once. I very rarely do. Yamaha guitar. Nothing. Ooh, don't mind if I do. Full of red eye. I'm already out of space. I need a bigger backpack. You think Igor can order one for me? Hey, finally. Something of interest. Wait. There we go. And nailed it. Oh, Vinny. Vinny, I know you can see this, Vinny. I know I know you're proud of me right now, Vinny. <laughs> I'm gonna make off with all the stuff. Watch there be like ten big burly men behind this door. Just you wait. So many interesting little things for me to steal, like money. More art. Why do they have the same art twice? Who does that? I don't know what you did to piss off the mob, but I'm sorry, okay? It's it's nothing personal. <gasps> Request done. Now, I'm probably in the clear, right? No police. I even have a hiding spot if I really need to. Is there anything else of interest in here? Inventory is full. Can't take the router. Uh, do I have any garbage in my inventory that I can get rid of? I don't know if a router is valuable. Probably not. I think I'm just going to grab the art and head out of here. Could really use a bigger backpack. Uh, that's got to be a top priority. Maybe the thieving website has it. Oh, oh, hold on. Don't don't get damaged. I gotta unlock the front door. There we go. You see nothing suspicious. No, I'm not. I'm not trespassing. I'm not trespassing. What's that guy's problem? I, I I own this place. Okay, I'm just walking out with some of my own fine art. God, some people are so freaking nosy. <laughs> Where did I park my car? Right there. Okay, okay. We're just gonna make a run for it. Could I go back in and get more stuff and load it into my car? Is that possible? Because technically, I'm in the clear right now, right? I'm not doing anything super suspicious. I gotta try. That, that's a lot of money on the table. Just gotta make sure nobody notices is all. Don't mind me, Fellow neighbors, no, no, I'm not doing anything shady. I'm just gonna come over here and look at my art in the bushes. <laughs> Why are there so many people walking around? I I'm just gonna leave it all out here. You know what, what if I just pile it up out front, then I'll back the car in, ooh. Don't mind if I do, you're, you're a big boy, okay? Well, we'll just put it all over here. Not, no, no, not doing anything shady, not doing anything shady, just planting some arts, don't mind me. I'm not doing something shady, okay? I'm just, I'm having a yard sale. If, if you want to buy a TV for real cheap, you know who to talk to. Now, I, I can hopefully just back the car up. 
<laughs> and then just load everything in and take off. If you can only take one big item at a time, I'm gonna be pretty pissed, okay? Somebody's gonna come home and find a lot of their crap just hanging out here. Uh, that. There we go. Okay. Everything is under control. We're gonna be quick. We're gonna be real quick. Okay. I don't think there's anybody coming down the road. Just, just load, load it in. Lo load it in. Load it in. No, I'm not. I'm not doing something. I'm not doing something shady. I'm not. I swear, I'm not doing anything shady. I'm just. I can't take it. I can only take one thing. There's so much car space. What is wrong with you? Do we take the big piece of art? Like this. This one. This one looks super big, right? This one looks more important than that one, I would say. So what if we uh, take you out, screw you, and we'll take you and uh, pop pop you in. Pop you in. I can't believe that I can only take one thing at a time. Oh, that is just a fury. Okay, somebody called the cops. Somebody called the, I, I pushed my luck. Get the hell out of here. <laughs> There's gotta be an easy way out of town, right? Oh, please, no, 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 they're coming, they're coming from there, I, I gotta, I gotta go this way, I didn't expect a high-speed chase right now. <laughs> turn around, turn around, I should just go hide in the dumpster, right? I, oh, the tenant came home, what? How did he come home and find that? Okay, this, this should lead to out of town, I'm not seeing any police. Oh yeah, master criminal, let's head over to the pawn shop. That wouldn't hurt the old stealth bonus, Vinny, but I made off with quite a bit of stuff. For the next task, I need you to learn how to climb a lattice. Like a man spider, you know? No, I don't know, and I'm not spending $1,200 on a pair of gloves, okay? We've already been over this. Hey, Igor, I got a whole lot of stuff for you today. Hold on a second. We just, uh, not a whole lot, actually. I would have loved to have had a whole lot, but I only made off with one piece of art. Welcome Hopefully, back. you give me something good for it. Right? Come on. 40 bucks? Are you kidding me? Do you have any idea how much trouble I went through to get that? The headphones that were just sitting on the back deck were worth twice as much. <laughs> vase, flower vase, Nokia cell phone, great. And I only have $1,000, so I can't even afford a pair of climbing gloves. I don't suppose you have a pair of climbing gloves back there. Air compressors and geez, just toasters for as far as the eye can see. Nothing. What's the good of you? You know what? I think that's going to be it for this episode of Thief Simulator, guys. And I got to say, this is quickly becoming one of my favorite series to make. Like, it is just so much fun. It really reminds me of House Simulator, except in this case, it doesn't really get monotonous. Like, there's constantly something new to be doing, there's progression, so I really like it. And the first episode got a ton of support from you guys. Just an enormous amount of likes. So as always, if you guys want to see more, be sure to leave a like on this video, let me know, and then maybe Vinny and I will return to rob and run over more people. But thanks so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time.